This is the summer of the supernatural and miracles. One thing you've got to understand that as a child of God, walk in the supernatural. The supernatural is able to help you to respond to situations. You know, people who walk in the supernatural, number one, they are not normal. They do things that are not normal. When everybody in the family tells them to go on the left, supernatural people go on the opposite. Because the rules and the protocols and the rules of the engagement, you have the ability to break all of them. Now, Jesus, walking on water does not mean you are going to walk on water. It simply means the source of your cases, you have power over it. Because the storms on the sea was coming from the water. So when Jesus walked on the water, he was saying that the source of the situation, I have power over it. Now, Peter gets ready to walk on. And he says, I've been a fisherman for 30 years. I've never walked on water before. And Jesus said, because of my word, you'll be able to do it. When the word of God is activated in your life, you walk in the supernatural. Yes, supernatural people, they walk behind and beyond the natural. Jesus. Say, I'm a person of the supernatural. I'm a person of the supernatural. Say, I'm a spiritual entity. I'm a spiritual entity. Now, before we read the test, at the first service, there's a family here. They have a serious court battle going on. And, and the one that they're having a court battle with, is, with has a, a sister. And the sister one day has told them that, listen to me, because you're having a court battle with my brother, I'll make sure I finish all of you. This is not a dream. This is physical. And this woman is a dangerous, dangerous, dangerous gangalia of a family. So all the time, they say they come to the altar and they pray to God, ten things are wrong. So on Friday, on Thursday, the mother is on the way. Um, the, the lady here, the mother also comes here. So the opponent is fighting them at the court. So the mother is getting ready to come to Trasaco branch at the service over there on Thursday. When the mother was dressing, the door of the wardrobe fell and hit the mother's leg. She went through pain and because of that, she couldn't come to the Trasaco branch. She said, when it fell, she said, God, de 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 deliver me and remember me. The same time, they had a phone call. That this family relative that is a gang and fighting people got accident at the same time and the two legs are broken. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Jesus. They were here at the first service. And they said, the way the legs are broken, doctor said she can never walk again. The same time, something hit the mother. Something hit the witch. It means it was coming against the mother, Jesus. and God brought a diversion. Yes, a person of the supernatural, anytime disaster is coming, Jesus. God brings a diversion. Yes, Let the altar here bring a diversion. Yes, Let the altar here bring a diversion. Yes, Listen, you are born to receive and enjoy the glory and the grace of God. Jesus. Say, I walk in the supernatural. I walk in the supernatural. Can I give you my test? Isaiah chapter 43, verse number 7. And because you are working the supernatural, all the, all, all the services to, to August, bring your bottles of oil. And also on the Fridays, you are having the 6 to 8.30 meetings. It's been so glorious. It's been so amazing by the grace of God. Amen. Um, um, let's, let's all read together. One, two, three. Let's go, please. Everyone who is called by my name, mm -hmm. whom I created for my glory, yeah. whom I formed and That's made. Right. Yeah. One more time. Let's go. Everyone who is called by my name, yeah. whom I created for my glory, yeah. whom I formed and uh -huh. made. Yeah, everyone who I created for my glory, formed and made. Everyone. So one of the reasons you are supposed to understand why God made you is for one reason. He created you, he made you for his. Glory. For his. Glory. For his. Glory. So help me to give the title of my sermon to your neighbor on your left and right and say my neighbor. My neighbor. If you don't show the glory, if you don't show the glory, God will not be happy. God will not be happy. You may be seated. Amen. God has a reason. God has a plan. When God is doing something, he is doing something because God is intentional. And when God is not doing anything, he is still doing something. Because when God is not doing anything intentionally, he is doing something behind the scenes. And any time God is quiet and God is silent, that is the time he's working for somebody behind the scenes. And if God is working for somebody behind the scenes, we ought to get time and see what exactly is going on. Now, the supernatural believer, number one, the Christian life is not a religion. The Christian life is a relationship. What is the relationship? I'm supposed to be like him. 
If I can be like him, I behave the way he behaves. Situations are not supposed to stop me from revealing who I am. Now, Pastor Daniel, why did God create man? From Sunday School 101, they told all of us, including yourself, whether you were in Roman, whether you were in Presby, whether you were in Methodist, they told us one thing. They said God made man for man to worship God. Am I saying the truth at all? I don't know what your Sunday School teacher told you. Now, contrary to popular opinion, I came to let you know that it is wrong. Pastor Daniel, why are you so controversial? I'm I excited you told me I'm controversial. Now, the reason why God made you from this test, he made you to show his glory. But any time you show God's glory, it's a sign of your worship. Because when people see the glory of God around you, they look at you and say, I worship your God. So if I don't show the glory, I'm not letting people worship the Lord. And my glory of God on me does not let people also worship God. And it does not also worship God. So glory is to worship God. Yes, so God made me to worship him. Okay, okay. From Sunday school 101. He made me to worship him. But now anytime people see me because of my case, they nod their head and say that the devil is wicked. Is it glorifying God? No. But when people see me, that what the doctor said about me, God has brought the turn around. They look at you and say, oh my God, come and worship the Lord with me. So the glory of God is a sign of my worship. That's right. The glory of God is a sign of my worship. The glory of God is a sign of my worship. Now we have a problem here. Now the Bible has used three different words. And if you sit down and you check the three different words, you might be confused. Because why would the Bible say, and I created you for my glory. I formed you for my glory. And I made you for my glory. God, why do you have to repeat yourself and get the revelation here? God never repeated himself. Everything written there is totally different. So now let's begin. I created you. I formed you. I made you. Tell the person around you, create. Create. Form. Form. Make. Make. Now this is it. Now, making or the made is the finishing product. So God now said one day, let us make man after our image. So after everything is being made, the end product is the made. What is the creation? Creation is making something out of nothing. So when God said, let us make man, let there be light. There was no light. Out of nothing, light appeared. So it is called creation. Now, after something is being created, what is being created? When you make something out of what is being created, it is being formed. And what is being formed, how you want the thing to become in your specification is the maiden point. So clear example, let me begin clear example. I moved to Eastern region, the forest of Eastern region, the forest of Brunhafer region, and I see a tree. Now the tree I see was created by God. The tree was not there and it appeared so great. Tree was? Good class, good class. Tree was? Three was Greater. now a sawmill operator takes a dormant machine, breaks the tree, and turns the tree into wawa balls. Now the wawa balls that have been made, that is ready for shipment at Tema Harbor. Now wood has been formed out of the created tree. Don't clap here. So the tree created, wawa board formed. Now. When the wawa board enters into China, it enters into America, a piano is made out of it. Mercedes-Benz wants to do a nice vehicle. On the right-hand side in the dashboard, some wood is on there. So the tree that was created, and, and wawa board formed out of it. Now, a nice panel, a piano, a nice bed, when you go to White House in Washington, D.C., the capital, the chair, the seat, the table, the President of America is sitting on in the Jubilee House of Ghana. It's a table that has been made out of the tree. So the making or the making is the end product. So when I appear in my family, hear me right now, I am created. What I came to meet in my family, I was formed. But I don't end with formation. Something big shows up in my life yes, and I made somebody victorious. Yes, 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 yes. So although I came from a family yes. where there was premature death, yes, yes. I will not be made for premature death. Yes, yes, yes. But when long life appears, Bye. oh, my family might be a family of poverty. Uh, but when God makes me a millionaire, I have been made 
So I start from creation. I get to formation. Yes, but my end will be glorious. Yes, All your friends who saw you Jesus. in 2015, Jesus. they only saw you in your form moments. Jesus. But when the glory of God shows up, oh you will be made into another man. Yes, Can I declare to somebody? In your season of supernatural, oh you are not going to remain in creation. Jesus not just being formed yes, yes. but god is about to polish you Jesus. now in the moment of polishing yes, he places some things on you Jesus. so that when people see you yes, they cannot recognize you yes, when people see you yes, they will see something different in you Jesus. because when the supernatural oh, glory shows up Jesus. you are created yes. you are formed and you are made. say preach daniel Preach Daniel. Preach Daniel. That's what I was born to do. That's right. Now sit down and look at this. Okay. Let me go to another scenario. Um, God declares, let there be. Say, let there be. Let there be. And God said, let there be iron on the ground. And all of a sudden, we have iron ore, right? Now, when we have iron ore, iron ore is being mixed. You know, um, the iron um, Fe3O2 from um, chemistry. You know, um, we join to other things. We have, you know, the steel, and um, steel is being formed. Now, when the steel is being formed, it gets to Germany in assembly plants of Mercedes Benz. Now, when the steel is being made, they look for some engine somewhere. They use, you look for some metals over there. When you go to the assembly plant and the manufacturing plant, what you see over there is dirty. You see engine. You see some metals. But after they join them together, being formed, they look for a sprayer. Sprays the vehicle in white, in black, in cream. And they move it from the assembly plant into the showroom. Now, in the showroom, you have different lights in the ceiling. When it gets over there, people will ask you one question, and you tell them, made in Germany. Wait, God created the iron. God created the iron ore. Human being formed steel out of it. And human being made a vehicle out of it. But when it was being done in the assembly plant, the car was ugly. But when it's being polished, you see something different. So when God is about to put his glory on you, he takes you to a moment of polishing. Now, after they do the polishing, they do something they call quality assurance. Quality assurance to make sure that this one has no issue. And they put a stamp of, of approval on it from R&D. When they put on it, they will now say that it is ready for market. So from Germany, it will get to England. It will get to Accra. It will get to Afghanistan. It will get to different places. But before it went out, there was a seal of approval. So when God created you, he placed a seal of approval. My God. So if you don't like me, I don't care. Because somebody else have already placed a, a, a seal, a seal, a seal of approval Jesus. over my life. Yes, so the Bible says, "Let the weak say I, I am, am strong. strong. Let the poor say I am rich." Because I don't move by what I see; ah. I move by what has been said yes, over my life. Yes, because what has been said over my life yes, is bigger than what I see. Because what I see was made by what God said. Sometimes, you hear me? Sometimes, if you don't believe what you see, believe what God said. That's right. So, so uh, you know, now, um, now, the same test, the same test. Let me say supernatural. Supernatural. Give me the KG version and see how it's so glorious over there. Look at it. Everyone that is called by my name, I've created him for my glory. glory. I have formed him. Now, the problem here is, yea, I have made him. Pastor Daniel, the yea that was placed there changes the whole scenario. I've created him. Okay, all right. I formed him, normal. Yea, I have made him. It has changed the scenario. What's the meaning? I wrote this book. I created it from my head. I formed the book. Later I say, yea, I made it. It means... I am so proud of the book. Because when I say, yeah, I made it. Sure. If you have any question, 
come to me. Yea, I made it. So look at me. The glory that is coming. Say it's not your mother. Say yes, it's not your father. Jesus. Before your father and your mother went on their first dates, God already had already approved of you already. Yes, he had already shown something great Jesus. over your life. Yay! Yes, I made you. Jesus. So if you don't like me, somebody already said they yes, made Lord. me. Jesus. Now, have you known this situation? It gives you the reason to walk in the supernatural. Because I'm supposed to show the glory of God. So now, why does trouble come to a human being? I'm, I'm very analytical because I read engineering, so I like to break things down so that we can argue. Can, can we argue? Right. Now, why does a trouble or trouble come on a person? Why? Why will you sleep one day, then trouble? Court case. There's issue. Will be a chantrato, so you go through this case. Let me tell you. The reason for every trouble in a person's life. The reason for every trouble. In, the reason for every trouble in a person's life is just one. So that you cannot reveal his glory. Because when trouble comes, the assignment of trouble from Satan is to cover you from revealing his glory. So anytime God gives me a testimony, trouble is being re removed, then I reveal his glory. Yes, Lord. So anything that stops you from revealing his glory Jesus. is trouble. So one day, Jesus, walking on the roadside, sees a blind man. And religious people said, Jesus, who sinned? Mother or father? Jesus said, shut up, keep quiet. Nobody sinned. But for the glory of the Lord to be revealed. So anytime there is trouble, it comes to cover the glory. But when the glory, trouble is removed, glory is revealed. Oh, I can, I, they, they can put this one on Twitter for me. When the trouble is removed, glory is revealed. When the it's trouble not. is removed, Glory is revealed. When the trouble is removed, glory, glory is, revealed. is revealed. So the assignment of trouble is to make sure you don't exhibit and reveal the glory of the living God. And today from this consecrated altar, yes. may you walk in the place of the supernatural. Amen. Now, now listen to me. Supernatural people cannot be understood. You cannot understand a supernatural person. There is a young guy in the Bible, the name is called Moses. Do you all remember him? One guy. You remember sure. him? When they gave birth to him, something strange happened. They took a basket, right? And um, they put a boy in the basket on top of River Now. Now, number one, River Now has a lot of crocodile. But they placed the boy in the River Now. Number two, he is in the basket. But somewhere, somehow, the boy did not sink. Clear example, now let's go to Achimdi's principle and law of flotation. Because the weight of the fruit displays, when it's equal to the weight of the object on it, it will sink. According to Achimdi's principle. So look at it right now. Now, go to the river in your area and look for a basket from your house. And Auntie Matilda, put just a stone inside of the basket. What will happen? Sink. Now, the weight of Moses and the stone, which one is bigger? Moses. So if anything is supposed to sink, it's not the stone. It's supposed to be Moses. But Moses was still floating. It means what sank other people? Jesus. You're about to float on top. Yes, Lord. Oh, 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 oh. Second service, Jesus. I can't feel you. I said, what sank other people? Yes, Lord. What brought other people down? Yes, Lord. I said, you shall float on top by fire. Yes, now, floating simply means elevation. So what brings other people down? I'm a person of the supernatural. Jesus. I am wired different. Yes, I am different. Yes, Shout, I am different. I am different. Say, I am different. I am different. Say, I am different. I am different. Say, I don't go by the laws. I don't go by the rules. I, don't go by the rules. I write my own laws. I write my own, I write my own rules. I write my own rules. Sit down for a minute. I'm trying my best. I'm trying my best. Thank you. Um, um, um. I have five minutes to finish and look at this right now. Um, the loss of Ghana is so amazing, right? But the conditions of Ghana affect people differently. Okay, let me come around the mountain. Here I come. The loss of Ghana is for everybody. If you cross red light, what happens? What happens? You are arrested. Good. 
The loss is for everybody. But the conditions are different. What's the condition? Somebody lives in your same area. The whole day, they will not get money to buy food. But you also live in the same area. But you eat and give some to your dog. So we are ruled by one law, by our con. Yes, Lord. Jesus. My God. We all graduated on the same day. Somebody will get job tomorrow. Somebody will take five years. We are all in the nation, but conditions are different. Jesus. So what causes my conditions to be different is when I become abnormal yes. because I work in the supernatural. Yes. So although it's taking five years to get jobs, I, I get a job the next day. Yes, Lord. Oh, the last person to say the amen will be there. Jesus. Uh, um, uh, many people don't know. Unfortunately, um, uh, people are supposed to pray in this nation. Tell somebody, pray in the nation. Pray in the nation. Now, the reason why you are supposed to pray for this nation now, forget about all your party colors. If you don't get to the realm where the, the nation prays, for God to bring people who have this one, we are in trouble. Uh, a statistics were being made, was being made it is in Ghana. And as of this year, from January to April, the number of applications that have entered into Canadian embassy this year, from January all the way to April, is 63,375 people. I'm repeating one more time. 63,375 people have made applications to go to Canada to leave the nation. Now, the number of applicants, only, this is only for four months. Now, the whole of last year, it was 62,151 people have made application. You might think it's a joke. Now, our human, human resources is going, skills are going, human capitals are going. When you are sick, a doctor that will help you is going. If you are not careful, we are being left with trouble. The mechanic that will do your car is going. The teacher that will teach your children is going. The driver that will drive you is. The lady that will do your seamstress. Uh, your makeup is, is doing what is good is going. So is, is, the plumber is going. Now Ghana you can't get plumber. In Ghana, if you want to get somebody to do POP, you are in trouble. If the person doesn't come from Togo, you are in trouble. Child of God, where the nation is going to. But there's a sharp rise because this year, low four months, 63,000. Last year, 62,000. 2021, Auntie Matilda, it was only 9,109. So, 9,000 only three years ago. Now, 63,000. And December has not come. Now, out of the 62,151 that applied last year, the success rate, the people that got their visas were 33,756. They are all gone. And out of the 33,000 that have gone, how many of them are come to help the nation back? They only come after they are 60 years, after they are 70 years. So human brain, human mind, to change everything is going. And what am I trying to say is the condition. But in as much as the condition is bad, I don't live in the economy of Ghana. Yes, Lord. I'm a supernatural person. Jesus. May something massive change on my behalf. Amen. So I came here to declare over your business and everything that you do. Jesus. May your business get to the next level. Yes, Lord. Oh, I don't have business people here. Yes, Lord. All the business people I came to declare over you. Yes, all entrepreneurs I declare unto you. Yes, all consultants. Yes, all business people. Yes, all corporate people. Yes, I move to your workplace. Yes, your promotion is coming. Amen. Your promotion is coming. Amen. Your elevation is coming. Amen. Jehovah is surprising you. Amen. Something is shifting yes, on your behalf. So it's changing on my behalf. Yes, Sit down for yes, a minute Lord. to finish. Jesus. Sit down for a minute to finish. So when I walk in the supernatural, now supernatural, hear me right now, becomes my lifestyle. When I don't like anything, I'm supposed to wake up in the morning. And declare that this family hear my voice. I am a candidate to change anything at all and everything. Child of God, supernatural people cannot be understood. And let me advise you. Everybody you see in life believes in something. There is nothing that is called an atheist. Somebody shows you I'm an atheist. It's a lie. Everybody's feet is on something. Some people tell you, oh, don't go to church and don't believe in it. They have where they go to. It's only, it's only the 21st century New Pentecostal Christian who only goes to church once in a month and 
they don't are not active and serious. When was the last time you placed your oil on your head? The Bible says, let not your head lack oil. But those who are into other things, they do it religiously. Child of God, there's a place you need to get to the realm. We don't move in the realm of the physical. We don't move in the realm of the physical. The person you are seeking the hand, you have no idea. If it's not the supernatural, a, te a testimony was given on Friday. The sister was here at the first service. A sister that husband died seven years ago. No, no, when the husband died, the husband left her a case of land, prime location. Seven years, nobody has told her. No, no, the document is with the husband's best friend. One day we're having a service over here. And, I, and she said, I declared that whoever has taken anybody's property, let the altar bring it back now. She said she was there. The first man friend called from America and said, I'm coming to Ghana. Can I meet you? She said, why? The person said, I want to meet you. He said, listen, I can't sleep. Your husband is hunting me. We bought this property. I have my own. My other friend has. And your husband's own is this. This is for you. Your name is on it. After seven years. This is it. This is the lady. Now, thank you. You can take it off. Now, hear me. It is not the husband that was hunting the man. It is the altar that was tormenting the man. My God, my God. So if anybody has taken what belongs to you, Jesus. let this altar be activated. Yes, I said your marriage, your favor, your long life, yes, your peace of mind, yes, the success of your children, yes, your pregnancy, yes, I release it to your direction. Yes, Say, I receive all of them. I receive all of them. Say, I'm a child of God. I'm a child of God. And I walk in the glory. I'm a walk in the glory. Now, this last one minute, this is it. Now, to walk in the supernatural, you are supposed to ask God to show you and take you to your location. Child of God, no matter what you carry, if you miss your location, you cannot exhibit his glory. Pastor Daniel, why? When you take a nice but have you seen a butterfly before? Oh, oh. Yes. Is it pretty? Yes. Is it beautiful? Yeah. Good colors. Yeah. Take the butterfly and put it in the air. It will show the colors well. Put the same butterfly in a swimming pool and tell the butterfly to swim. swim. The, the colors will go away. So it's not about you don't carry something you know, where you are. Yeah. The one that is clapping, you got my revelation. You can be good, but wrong location will shock at you. But with the supernatural, it orders your steps Jesus. for you to be at the right place, yes, at the right time, Jesus. to meet the right person. Yes, second, scenario, second scenario, um, take a nice tilapia fish and throw it in the air and put it by your house on the, on the grass and tell tilapia swim. It will be like this more. It will die off. Because the fans and the girls cannot do anything again. Child of God, where are you located? Are you at the right location? Even in church, which church are you planted? Which altar are you planted? You see a nice G65 Gulf Stream, private jet, amazing. Put a nice G65 on the Temamoto way and tell the private jet. Fly on the motorway, let's see. It was cut off in my crash. G65, $40 million, $50 million. But it can skid off and fall down. Because it was not made for Tema Motorway. But the same G65, put it in the air. And you see how it will flow. People are telling you are nobody. Because you are on a motorway. But let them get ready for you in the air. Yeah. What is inside yes, of you, Jesus. show up in Jesus' name. Can take one of the nice. One of the best and nice private jet um, is owned by a Saudi Arabian man, Prince Awalid Ben Tala. Amazing. Inside of it has gold interior. Media, do they have it? Do they have it? Look at it right now. Crazy. 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 Amazing. 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 But, the, the, but, but no, but the top one, give me the top one. The top one is for Prince Awalid, the owner of Four Seasons Hotel. That the first one you place on there. Thank you. That, that one, private jet. Prince Our Lead. Um, he's, he's also a shareholder in Citibank in America. Um, plenty of um, companies. He owns different, different percentages inside. And this private jet, if you come and put this private jet on the Spinters Road, <laughs> and you tell the private jet, fly. The, 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 the private jet will start crying. 
It has been to, 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 to. because the location is not good. Some of you, God made you like Prince Awali's Jets, but where you are kept is not exhibiting his glory. Jesus. But as a man of God, I came to move you to yes, a place Lord. where the glory will be revealed, Jesus. where the glory will be revealed, Jesus. where the glory will be revealed. Jesus. Now, anything stopping your glory Jesus. by the altar in the testimony city, Jesus. I reverse it, I divert yes, it, Lord. I change it right now. Yes, Turn the altar, Turn the altar. Yes, Something is changing. Something Jesus. is moving. I reverse Yes, I move, yes, I change, yes, I turn it around. Yes, let the altar, 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 let the altar. When you tell that you move, then you tell that you move. Let the altar, man of God, let's do for me. Yes, let the altar, Zaba, Lato, Zakaya, Yaya, Lebranda, Zekaya. Let the altar be activated. That's what it's city. Yes. Yes. 